Hey, Trip Kramer here from TripAdvice.com, and on today's video, I'm going to be going over seven different compliments that women love to hear, and these have been vetted and tested, and I know that women really like to hear these. So we're going to go over these and why they work, and it's cool because every single one of these compliments are pretty different. You know, I'm not going to be giving you seven of the same compliments. They it kind of are in different areas, which you'll see in just a second. So let's go over these right now. The first one is, I love your smile. Now, this is going to be one of the only ones I'm going to be giving you that's going to be complimenting her on her appearance, okay? I don't really like compliments that are focusing on her appearance unless you've been in a relationship with her for quite some time. Then, you know, in the relationship, your girlfriend, she's going to love to hear those compliments that she's beautiful and pretty and and all those things. But when you first meet a girl, when you're dating her, you've been on a few dates or maybe you just meet her, you want to stay away from anything that's too uh, complimenting on her looks because she gets those a lot and they're not really special coming from a stranger. However, this one is really great. I love your smile. I don't know what it is. I don't know why girls light up when they hear this, but it's a unique compliment that they don't hear and, and it's very sweet. It's very PG. You're not complimenting her on some body part, but her smile, which is a really nice thing to hear. I bet you if you heard that you had a nice smile too from a girl, it'd probably make you feel pretty awesome too. So this is one that goes a long way. Now here's another one. This is more complimenting her on her intelligence. Women love to be complimented on their intelligence. They want to know from a guy that the guy thinks that they're smart. Again, this is opposing to just complimenting her on her look. She wants to know that the guy is attracted to them more so on who she is as a person and less on just what her body looks like. And and this is the way I want you to say it. You know, it'd be pretty lame if you're just like, oh, you're very smart or, oh, you're intelligent. But you can do it in a nice flirty way. You can say, you're a smart one, aren't you? And you kind of look at her with a little half smile, squinting your eyes and say, you're a smart one, aren't you? Whenever she says something that you think is really intelligent or or maybe in the middle of conversation when you guys are having uh, some sort of deep conversation, you know, you're a smart one, aren't you? And obviously it's kind of a rhetorical question. You're not really looking for an answer here, but this is a way of complimenting her on her brains. Next is you have a good taste in blank. So whatever this is, this could be anything, but basically the things that she likes. It could be movies, it could be music, it could be art, anything that you think she has a good taste in. It could be style, it could be friends, uh, you know, anything that someone likes, and then you compliment her on the fact that she has a good taste in that. And that's a great compliment to hear. And let me tell you something. This is a very original one. I don't think a lot of guys are complimenting a girl on this. And here's where I give the disclaimer that I maybe should have said about a couple minutes ago. But please, if you are giving a compliment, do it because you actually mean it. Don't just say these things because I'm telling you here that they work. Hopefully, she does have good taste in something, or you believe she does, and that's why you're saying it to her, or she does have a nice smile, or you actually think that she is intelligent, and you'll say the last one that we did. So make sure you actually mean it. All right, let's go to the next one. I'm so attracted to you. This is a really good one. This is a good one. Now, I want to give a little disclaimer on this one. This is not one that you're going to say when you first meet her. This is not one you're going to say even on the first or second date. This is something you say to a girl when you guys have gotten to know each other pretty well. So we're looking at at five plus dates here to give this compliment, okay? Five plus dates. That means you guys have been on a lot of dates. You're either in a relationship or you're headed that way or you spent a good enough time together where you can say to her, I'm so attracted to you, right? It's very, very powerful right here. But again, if you say it too soon, you're going to be coming off too strong and it might scare her. So only do this when you feel like you guys have spent enough time together where you're very comfortable in front of each other and you can give her this very intense and powerful compliment. You look her in the eyes or maybe you guys are just on the phone, whatever it is, and you just say, I'm so attracted to you. And you do it in a way where you're not desperate, like I'm so attracted to you, but you're just kind of like almost in wonder when you say, like, I'm so attracted to you. Like, how did this happen? How did it get to this point? I'm so attracted to you. So again, something you want to say when you guys are more comfortable together. 
The next one is you're very easy to talk to. Okay, you're very easy to talk to. And this is one that could absolutely come more in the beginning when you first meet her um, all the way up to when you guys have been on multiple dates. You're very easy to talk to. And this is a really good compliment because it's also showing your interest, but it's telling her, hey, you make me feel comfortable. You may, that's what you're basically saying. You, you make me feel comfortable. You're very easy to talk to. And you're also saying to her that you guys have this really nice connection. You guys have a strong connection. You're like, you're like, you're just very easy to talk to. You have fun with her. You enjoy spending time with her when you guys are just talking. Like, so use this one in the midst of conversation. Here's another one. You have a really cool style. You have a really cool style. This could be an opener. This could be something that you start conversation with. This is something that you could say maybe on a first date. You're complimenting her on the way that she dresses herself, basically. And this is a really good way to do it. Basically just saying that her overall look, her overall appearance, but not, not her actual body, but the way she puts herself together is really cool. You have a really cool style. And you say it to her just like that. You have a really cool style. You know, and you can maybe even compliment her on something she's wearing, you know, something uh, like a necklace or a bracelet or a hat or whatever it is that you think is cool about her style. But this is another one you could use, again, if you really think that she has a cool style. And here's another one, and this is really powerful too, and this is one that you're going to say, again, on somewhere between two to three plus dates. You say, I have a lot of fun with you. And it's, you know, I know this, this sounds like so simple. These are just really generic compliments. But I'm telling you, when you deliver them in such a way where you actually mean it and you're giving her really good eye contact, it's all about the delivery and the execution and less about the words. But still, these words are very powerful. You're telling her that you like spending time with her. You enjoy spending time with her. This one is kind of similar to you're very easy to talk to, but that one's more specific about your actual conversations. This one is more overall. I have a lot of fun with you. I enjoy spending time with you. And a girl's going to love to hear that. And that's going to be a really powerful compliment. Again, two plus dates, you're going to say this one. I have a lot of fun with you. Now, beyond compliments, you're going to have to talk to girls. You're going to have to have things to say. And lucky for you, I put together a free gift called Chick Crack, conversation topics that women love. That means that I have conversation topics that you can bring up in conversation that are going to get women to enjoy the conversation and make it easy to continue conversation because they're topics that women love to talk about. So in order to get this, all you got to do is go down to the description below, go in the description and look for the link and it's called Chick Crack and it's 100% free. It is for you to learn how to be able to bring up the conversation topics that get conversation going and like I'm saying here, that women love to talk about. So go get that in the description. That's 100% free. Also, I want to hear from you. If you have a compliment that you think is really powerful that you like to give girls, I want you to write that down in the comments below. Let's get a bunch of compliments in there so we can start to use these and help each other out because I know that even though we want to be using these compliments, there might be other ones that we might not think of that are great to use. And of course, we only use them if we're being real and authentic with them. But let's write them down in the comments below. Go check out Chick Crack and I'll see you on the next video.